Hey, it's Jason Judy here from Centric, and today I'm going to show you a demonstration of getting a MIDI in and out of the iPad simultaneously using the iPad camera connection kit. Uh, I've got the camera connection kit hooked up over here via this dock extension cable. So for more information on why I'm doing that and the benefits of it, check out the episode 2 video. So, what I'm going to do here for the demo is use the little MIDI machine step sequencer app on the iPad to send MIDI out uh, into my Motu MicroLite MIDI interface, and then it will go into my Innovation Base Station analog synth, uh, being completely sequenced by the iPad here. So, let me fire up a sequence that I've programmed into the little MIDI machine. It's, of course, everyone's favorite, Pink Floyd's On the Run from Dark Side of the Moon. And I'm going to crank up the tempo so it'll start to come into form for you. All right, well, let's go take a look at the synth rack and see the action over there. Okay, so you see on the base station the uh, blinking light there, that is the MIDI indicator uh, saying that it is receiving MIDI, and that's the notes actually that you see being fired. And if I look over in the right corner, you can see on the Motu micro light interface right there, uh, you see the MIDI uh, lights blinking there as well, and in the bottom left corner you see the two MIDI cables. And that's where the MIDI is coming in from the iPad camera connection kit. So it's a USB plug on one side and then the standard 5-pin MIDI DIN on the other side. So it goes into the Motu there, and then the Motu is hooked up on the back side to the analog synth. Okay, so for an extra little fun twist, I'm going to fire up the MIDI Designer app here. And this is just a template I threw together real quick with a filter resonance and ADSR to control the base station. And um, these controls are all sending control change messages out of the iPad through the MIDI cable into the base station. So that you can control the base station from the iPad here just like you were using the knobs on the actual unit. fun stuff. So to complete the demonstration, uh, while this is sending MIDI out, we're going to throw a little another Pink Floyd ditty in here to demonstrate MIDI coming in. There you go. 
I figured I'd end with a little hands-on control on the bass station just to prove that that was actually the instrument being played. So uh, that's the demo for today. You can uh, check out some more demos on my channel or always go to centricmusic.com and download some of my material for free. Peace.